Hello everyone, this is Ashwit from Paraguay Technologies. Welcome to this video demonstration on creating and using incoming documents in Microsoft Dynamics NAV. In this video, I will demonstrate how to create an incoming document and use incoming documents for creating purchase or sales documents in Dynamics NAV. Let's understand what are the incoming documents. So, every business receives various documents either in the form of soft copy or hard copy. These documents can be used to create documents in NAV such as purchase invoices, credit memos. So let's start by creating an incoming document in NAV. Type incoming documents in the navigation bar and open the page. Click create from file and select the PDF file that was received from a vendor. In this case, I am using progressive home furnishings that comes with the standard Kronos click open now here you can see at the main attachment that the file is attached you can click open this file from here once we have a document we can manually create the purchase invoices or we can send the documents to OCR services then receive the data in an XML format to generate automated documents this will be shown in the upcoming videos so let's do the same thing manually click on navigate and click create manually here you can see various available options first let's first let's create a purchase invoice Select the vendor, in this case it's progressive home furnishings, enter the vendor invoice number and quickly select the items. I will select the items that is available in the PDF file that we have attached. Here you can see that the fact box is showing the documents that is used to create this purchase invoice. We can match the total with the invoice here. Yes, it's matching. And we can post this purchase invoice from here. Now next I will create a journal, so click on create from file, click on create manually in the navigate bar. Here we can create a journal, but before creating a journal, click on the setup to set the templates and batch for incoming documents. Now create the journal, a line number gets assigned, so click on this record and fill in the information, for example, Balance account type should be vendor and the number should be progressive home furnishing. Balance account number is progressive home furnishings. Put the amount. And now we can post the journal. Once the journal is posted, we can navigate to the posted entries from record. You can see that the incoming documents is available in the back box. I will now open the vendor ledger entries and see how the incoming documents is handled there. Open the vendors page, open the relevant vendor card and click on the ledger entries. Here you can see that the incoming documents file fact box is showing the file that we have attached with the journal. So 
So this files can be used in future for any audit purposes or for any requirement that is required for reconciliation. We can also navigate to the posted entries for incoming documents. In the upcoming videos, you will see this process fully automated with OCR and ICR service integration where we will be having minimum user interface. In this video, I have demonstrated how to create an incoming documents from file, create a purchase invoice manually, create a journal using an incoming document, how to view the incoming document with the unposted and posted entries. Thanks for watching this video. For more information, please visit www.paraguide.com.